Hong Kong is the birthplace of Chinese action movies. Kung Fu heroic figures in the movies are household names that have made many people fall in love with Chinese martial arts and become practicants. Qinghu, Hong Kong, has turned into the home for these people. Li Xiaoquan, Vice President of Qinghu, Hong Kong, who has taken on the position for more than 10 years now. Every morning, he and his pupils will go to the park to practice martial arts. One of Master Li's best Kung Fu skills is Fu's Ba Gua Zhang, which is a Chinese traditional boxing feature, quick palm, and foot movements. This soft but fierce fist routine was shown in Hong Kong film The Grand Master by Chinese director Wong Kar Wei in 2012. One of the characteristics of our Fu's Ba Gua Zhang is a lot of turns, turning like a dragon soaring. This is called the Eagle Claw. And this is the Flying Dragon. Ba Gua Zhang usually turns in a circle every eight steps, three smaller steps, like this, twist, lock, twist, three steps, make it smaller, one more. In addition to Ba Gua Zhang, Li Xiaoquan is also a master of Mi Zong Ahart boxing, a feast routine of the same calm as Huo Yuanjia's secret family kung fu called Mi Zong Yi. Bruce Lee's Feast of Fury is based on Qin Wu. So when the film was out, so many people came to us. Students in particular, they were very much into our boxing, because Bruce Lee's footwork is from our North genre. As Hong Kong being an international hub, many masters have accepted overseas apprentices and many foreign pupils came to Hong Kong to learn Chinese martial arts. Now retired, Li Xiaoquan is devoting most of his time teaching and spreading martial arts to the world. Dr. Zhou from the Philippines is a well-known veterinarian. Outside of work, he has been a fanatic of Chinese Kung Fu. Besides following Master Li for years, the two also set up Qin Wu in the Philippines. Now, Zhou has his own understanding on the true meaning of Kung Fu after being a practitioner for half a century. And I think that philosophy of uh, to welcome every individual who has a talent, to help contribute his talent to the good of a bigger group, so we spread the culture around. But more importantly, we spread the goodwill. The thinking that we learn to fight, but we don't have to fight. We learn to fight so we can all be good friends. That is a very good, really, I mean, he must have been a very brilliant individual. Qin Wu Hong Kong offers martial arts class to the public regularly. People are here to learn, including retired elderly and busy working young. Children are frequent visitors here. Eagle Claw, Wing Chun, Ba Gua, more than 20 types of martial arts are available to choose from. I've been practicing Kung Fu for 10 years since middle school. I learned from my master and senior fellow apprentice. Sometimes I pass my experience to junior pupils as well.
Chinhu Hong Kong was registered officially in 1922. Till now, it has nearly 95 years of history. Although there have been several times of changes on location and personnel, but the inheritance never interrupted. Chinhu carries forward Chinese martial arts with persistence and love, generation after generation. TJTV World.